All right, so hi, what's up, everyone? This is Gaurav. You're watching Computer Freaks, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install WordPress locally on your system, so that you can create those WordPress websites first locally on your system, without making it live, and then maybe later on taking it live when you feel like it. Um, I'll be explaining the first part, that is how to install WordPress locally, and maybe I'll make another video explaining how to take it live later on. So first of all. Uh, we need a software known as Bitnami WordPress. All right, so now we've got this Bitnami WordPress website thing. So I'm just going to directly hit this Windows Mac Linux option and I'm going to download for Windows 64 bit. So no thanks, just make me the download. All right, so as you can see, the download is complete and I'm going to let it install. There we have. I'm going to select English. Fine. I'm going to hit next. I'm going to hit next again. I'm going to hit next. Okay, now you're going to set some details. Your real name, Gaurav, your email address, can be anything. Login, you can add anything. Just make sure that you remember the login ID and password. I'm going to hit, I'm going to hit next. I'm going to hit next. Do you want Gmail support? If you want Gmail support, you can hit here and you can i don't want it right now i'm gonna hit next launch wordpress website launch wordpress in the cloud with it now i'm gonna hit next i'm gonna hit next and now it starts installing so sit back relax get a cup of tea i don't know let it install man all right so windows firewall is blocked it i'm gonna hit allow access because it says firewall has blocked some features so i'm gonna hit allow again all right so now the installation is completed it says launch wordpress stack i'm gonna hit finish and it's gonna take me here so all you gotta do to access your wordpress dashboard is hit allow hit access wordpress and here we are all right so now if you want to log in into your wordpress account all you gotta do is uh, add a login to your url that is okay so it's 127.0.0.1 it basically means localhost you can also write it as localhost okay so both are the same thing localhost slash wordpress slash login i'm gonna hit enter and we get the username and password thing which we entered previously okay so my username was admin and the password was i'm gonna hit login and here i am yeah, so that was the tutorial on how to install WordPress locally on your system. I will make a part two very soon on how to make this, how to take the website that you make locally, online, live. Um, so until that time, don't forget to like the video, share the video with your friends and comment down below what next tutorial you want me to do. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.